I think there are two. There are two, and uh, it's a very good question because I wish that I had been uh, given that advice when I started. Uh, because when we started in 2012, actually, across Africa, there were very few uh, online businesses back then. And uh, <laughs> it's 2018, right? And uh, the business is still significantly smaller than what I expected to be and what I want it to be. So I think the first uh, advice is be patient. Mm -hmm. Be patient, and with patience actually comes uh, resilience. Those countries are extremely promising. The markets are growing very fast. The GDP growth you know, in those markets is really, really high compared to the developed markets. Uh, that being said, you start from a small base, and it takes time. Then, of course, you know, there are snowball effects as you grow, but it does take time. It does take time, actually, to grow and convince the customers. Hence, my second advice is about the customers. Uh, the customers, I think that the needs of the customers are universal, but the way that you serve the customers or you engage with the customers or you talk to the customers can differ. And what is working in more mature markets does not necessarily work in, in the copy-paste mode in our markets. So you need to be very close to the customer. You really need to listen to them. Ask them a lot of questions to understand which problems you're solving for them. And I, I think that's very, very important.